UK retail sales dropped sharply in March as the rising cost of living hit consumer spending. That's according to official data out today. The volume of retail sales fell far more than predicted, with online sales hit particularly hard as consumers reined in discretionary spending on luxuries and other non-essential items. Why? Because as the prices of food and fuel have skyrocketed, buying the basics now takes up an ever-rising share of household incomes. Retail sales in the UK fell no less than 1.4% in March compared to the previous month. And within that total, online sales were hit particularly hard, falling 7.9% compared to February as consumers tightened their belts. These downbeat numbers are a clear sign high inflation is now translating into a serious economic slowdown. And as the cost of living squeeze gets tighter, house and household energy bills rising in April and tax rises kicking in, retail sales are likely to fall even more. Separate data out today from the research company GFK suggests that while retail sales fell in March, so far in April, consumer confidence has plunged even more to its lowest level since the 2008 financial crisis. I guess one bit of good news, for those with a mortgage anyway, is that because of this retail slowdown and consumer confidence nosedive, the Bank of England, which increased interest rates from 0.5 to 0.75% last month, may, may hesitate before pushing up rates more. The question remains, though, UK retail sale volumes are falling sharply and they're set to go down further. And that's our On The Money question today. How can the UK reverse this slump in retail sales?